What up, auction mamas and papas? Here is preview video for our next auction. Thursday, July 26th, 2012, 3177 Mercer in Kansas City, Missouri, right off of 31st Street between Southwest Boulevard and Southwest Trafficway. Uh, auction gets going at 6 p.m. Preview available after 5 p.m. And uh, we finished around 10 p.m. Hopefully earlier. Not a very big auction, so trying to stay cool. Hope you are successful. Okay, we'll start down here at this end with some stuff. There's a little Matchbox City, Matchbox Country. Nice old uh, poker set. Tel uh, telephone. I don't think that's a repro. Maybe it is. Uh, or has it been turned to a radio? I guess so. Anyway, G.I. Joe Hong Kong clothes. Kind of neat. Bunch of military stuff in here. That's cool. Little thing for Signal Corps to practice. That's, you know, probably $20 piece on Mannions. All sorts of good stuff. Uh, Sheepskin, then we have uh, E. Ingram, uh, Fantasy Island, or Fantasy Island, uh, Treasure Island Banjo, Clock, 8 Day, Key Wound, very desirable piece, as I understand it, super clean condition, uh, works just great, uh, I'm not going to hang it up here and get it going, the people, you know, it was working when they took it off the wall, it's all packed up nice and tight. So we're going to leave it like that. Very cool piece. Um, e. Ingram Treasure Island uh, Banjo Clock. Alright, uh, empty Diet Coke bottle. All sorts of cool stuff here. That's neat, the gentleman who can sign this airplane said that he built it when he was a boy and never finished it. And he is a World War II veteran. So, that's old. The old uh, cooler type thing there. This is uh, Elkhorn trumpet. More military stuff here, Marine Corps stuff. German, looks like uh, Royal Korean Marines. These are cool. I should have pulled them out ahead of time. Binoculars made from uh, optics of uh, I don't know like a mortar or something like that and it's a World War II era German case we've got uh, World War II uh, German uh, police helmet a couple US items a liner and then a helmet with a liner a couple nice reference books there uh, in the case it's kinda light this time we're alright with that nice Yadro Mother Mary, sterling weighted candlesticks, uh, some more, couple more sterling pieces in there, some sterling jewelry, pretty cool. Those are Kansas City A's, uh, elephant rings. Got a couple World War II German bad guy pieces in there. Some nice glass pieces. Look at that, huh? Where else are you gonna find one of those? Except maybe a truck stop. Swords. There's a set of the uh, Vietnam Experience Time Life books. Nice old cast iron uh, bookends. There's a nice one doorstop. Uh, neat Zenith radio. Pretty cool. Multi band. Nice little little set here. Different stuff. Paul Sebastian. This is uh, Austin Sculptures. Other good stuff. Pheasant. Ah, another one. My goodness. Uh, World War II era China. Nicely, uh, that set's nicely marked. There's a neat box there. Vintage curtains and material seem to do well. Uh, got some Navy, World War II, no it doesn't look World War II, but 50s probably. 
Navy, uh, the Chief Petty Officer. Cool stuff. There's a Vietnam uh, woodland camo jungle jacket. Hey, look at these two old suitcases. What? It's a stereo. These are the speakers in this one. Cool globe light. Carnival glasses. Old trays. Reels. Nothing fancy, but this is nice. Nice Russell Wright pieces there. Uh huh. That uh, pot is Griswold. Hand embroidered stuff, more vintage retro stuff. Look at this big box full of sports collectibles. We'll sell it all one money. Bam. Pretty cool. Stuff there. More stuff. Horse show. Something or other. More military stuff. Man, we're getting a lot of military stuff. Which is cool because I've always been interested in it and we've had quite a bit and so it's caused more people to call because they know we're uh, getting good prices. Yeah, but then people are getting good deals on, on stuff too. You know, it's just um, neat uh, area of collecting interest. Okay, then we'll go over here. Some retro lamps, tables. Consigner said those two brass and glass shelves stacked onto each other somehow. We couldn't figure it out, but that's how we're doing it right there. That's a good form chair. Nice little fountain. Floor lamp, very nice, very nice. Another retro office chair. Okay, some little pieces here. Let's go back here, look at the guns. 1903 uh, Remington 12 gauge semi auto. Here is uh, some Enterprise Arms 12 gauge double barrel. I believe that's a little Remington 22 there. Pretty cool. Okay, uh, let's get back to this furniture then. That stuff there. A couple more little cool retro patio type tables maybe. Three safes. Pretty cool. All, all of them have the combinations and all that there. So yeah. Nice uh, mid-century uh, headboard and footboard. Uh, the rest of it is or, or yonder. We'll head there in a second. A couple of those kind of lamps there. So many uh, planting type shelves, plant racks, baker's racks, whatever you want to call them with glass shelves. This one needs a few glass shelves cut, but a lot of them are there. A couple of very, very nice wing back chairs in brand new like condition. Even smell good. Nice little cast, cast iron stool there. The lady who consigned it said it was her grandmother's, I believe. There's uh, side tables that match that. Nice uh, chest that matches it. Pretty cool. Can't remember who made it here. Oh, dang it, I'm sorry. There we go. Uh, starts with a B, ends with a Z. You can't hardly make it out. Anyway, there's the there's a dresser goes with it. Mirrors hang on the wall. At least they were at this house. Nice glass dining table with chairs, six chairs. Super, super nice rug. There's a plant, fake plant. And we got more. Nice uh, royal palace. Uh, there's paperwork on the rug. There's that set there. Nice. Nice clean stuff in great shape. Sewing machine cabinet, it's you know different than the cabinets you normally see. A little Kenmore in there. Entryway type glass table. The ugliest lamp ever made. Turn that fan off. Nice oak table. Look at those feet. Pretty cool. There's a runner. And then a jungle of fake 
foliage, foliage, foliage. Okay, and then check this out. All these dresses, like formal gowns, like I guess prom type dresses and other stuff. We're going to sell that rack. We're going to sell this rack, wedding dresses in there too. Sell that rack of them. So help me out, spread the word that we have all these dresses because uh, not normally so stuff that we deal with, but you know, there's definitely value there. And anytime I see a huge collection amassed in one place, I just always think it's kind of kind of cool quantity. And then there's all like this kind of stuff, tiaras and handbags and gloves. And then not this week look at all of them we have so uh, yeah if you know anyone who's interested please send them our way we'll have those for a couple few options to come a little cart there and we have a bunch of patio furniture print stuff there a little uh, chest checkerboard tables kind of cool outdoor furniture Outdoor furniture, outdoor furniture, movie posters. Look at all of the old ones there. Pretty cool. So we'll do choice on those. Then there's a Freddie Pawtech poster and uh, Jorge Brett, Kansas City's patron saint. All right, then we got some more artwork over here. Little shelf thing. Look at the pictures, at the photographs. Folks, I took pictures of the uh, artist's signatures. Um, it's like some, some pretty cool stuff. This one's Joan Parker. Anyway, then uh, some TWA stuff. Beer mirrors and beer bar type stuff. Kind of cool. Okay, then we'll do choice on this table, folks. Choice, if you haven't been to the auction before, you get around the table here and we all, everybody starts bidding and whoever gets the highest bid uh, gets choice off of that area uh, pretty much. Uh, it gets to take however many they want for, for that money. So you, you get three things and the bid was $50, so it's $50 times three. Depression glass, the retro glass. That was kind of cool. More military stuff. Uh, models haven't been messed with. good stuff here folks all this good stuff we got a couple gaps in the tables we could have put more stuff in added another consigner but we done this is it folks good stuff gonna be a good auction buffalo other great pieces all right then we will high tail it over here and do choice again some cool stuff down here there's pong needs a, I believe it's a 12 volt male power cord. I'm going to try to find one in the meantime, but didn't come with one, so. All this good stuff. Lots of china, art glass. So, uh, yeah, there you have it, and uh, see you on Thursday.